All right, welcome back, everybody. Let's get some Twitter now because uh, I think a lot of people have been watching the interview with uh, uh, Palessa and Terry and have been adding their voice to the conversation. So let's see what you've been saying. Uh, this is coming from uh, Libé Swiss saying, uh, that's a valid point. P please shouldn't always... Uh, try to move from their location. Hello, Terry Petto. I imagine that people shouldn't move. Um, Nko Weni saying, beauty lady there. Hello to Terry Petto, our inspirational woman. So glad you're enjoying it. Uh, Tsotso M saying, you are the black girl who rocks. We are proud of you, Terry Petto. So Terry making South Africans proud. Wando Moleko saying, Terry, please come advise little girls in Mamelodi school. Um, it's the key, please. I suppose it's always great to see these real life inspirations, aren't they? And when young girls see them, they have goals to work towards. And I think Terry is one of those amazing goals to walk to work towards. Uh, Matapelo saying, a bright star from the Val. Would you consider helping an aspirant scriptwriter? I have so many stories to tell. Wanda, beautiful sister of our country. We are very, very proud of you. Wanda Moleko, writing at Morning Live SABC. Terry is a beautiful soul, inside and out. Go and break boundaries, girl. And finally, this is from, um, gosh, uh, Missy Lady, I think. Sorry, I'm not reading it too well. I never knew she grew up at Everton. I admire her work and her beauty, our South African pride. I love her. Well, there you go, Terry. South Africans loving you. I think you know that already, but it's always good to hear that, isn't it? So uh, let's continue our conversation with uh, Terry Petto, and she's joined by a friend now. Uh, Palessa, who have you got with you now? All right, thank you so much, uh, Leanne. But just before we talk to Mampo, who's Terry's BFF, let, let's just get you respond. The love from South Africans. It's amazing. It's overwhelming. I really appreciate that. Mm. really like it really warms my heart i get yeah. emotional mm -hmm. and i think there was a question terry about uh, if you ever consider going to schools maybe for motivational talks or maybe mentor um, script writers mm -hmm. i mean I, I have a couple of people that i work with like you know uh young filmmakers but you know going to high schools is you know part of the of the plan mm -hmm. i i hope in the new year we'll have more time because mom and i are working on a couple of projects that you know we want to give back to the young people so all right uh, we'll definitely all right make now let me just formally introduce your best friend we know that friends are known to give you support when you need it they share fun moments they make each other laugh they also create memories and also to take on great business ventures together well that last part is only true for media powerhouses mom Popresci and terry peter um, these two besties are launching their educational toy business Let's Learn Toys. Uh, it actually aims to democratize um, education and provide children everywhere with uh, available tools to make learning accessible, affordable, but most importantly, fun. Terry was here earlier. She's still here. And Mampo joins us now to take this uh, discussion on their business venture further. Good morning to you and thank you so much for coming through. And good morning. And good thank you for having me. Good to see you. Yeah. When I see you, I see Iris, but I think you different from that one. Right. I, I would <laughs> hope I'm different. Yeah. <laughs> are you different from her? I mean, I think there's, there are a lot of things um, that, that, you know, differentiate us, I think. Yeah. Uh, Iris is not real, for starters. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> Um, she's, she's a woman who, um, has very little, I would say, moral standing. Um, she, she does not consider consequences at all. Very when devious. She, yeah, when she's she, very devious. um, acts or, 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 you know, carries out her, her business. So, yeah, I would say that I think I'm, I'm pretty morally grounded. Mm -hmm. But I think you get a lot of that when you walk around malls and around streets. People refer to you as Iris, isn't it? Of course, they do identify yeah. with the character. And um, I would assume that, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm doing a good job. So yeah. it's hard for them you to differentiate. You certainly are. Yeah. Get, uh, yeah, take it from me, you are. You are you. doing great. But what have you been up to? Um, uh, we have been concocting and planning and putting together this um, little uh, giving birth, I would say, this little baby of ours, um, Let's Learn Toys. Um, so, yeah, um, yeah. That's what we've been doing. That's what you've been busy yeah. with. No, you've been, you've been busy as well. I mean, I've been busy. I've been, you, you know, know the I, Italian link. Yes, and, I'm, um, yeah, doing work with, with, the, with the Italian link. Mm. Um, That's what friends are for. Next, she reminds she you. She reminds yeah. me <laughs> of all the things that I'm doing. Um, she reminds me to keep motivated. She reminds me how good I am. Yeah. And, 
Um, but but we know, ladies, that what they say about you know going into business as friends, or you shouldn't be mixing business with pleasure. How are you two keeping it so tight and getting it right, Terry? Well, we have a lot of sleepovers. We I think do. that helps. Okay. Um, <laughs> no, on a serious note, I think you just need to know you know the person that you uh, getting into any partnership with. Getting into bed with. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's where we started. <laughs> Yeah, I just like um, know them and know their heart, know their dreams and ambition. And, and because I know she is passionate about, you know, this business venture. Uh, so it kind of makes sense for us. Like we have so many things in common outside business, but this is something that brings us together yeah. and we can grow and, mm -hmm. and, and learn from each other. And um, yeah, and I mean, look, it's, create it's literally legacy. like getting married, you know, and when you get married, mm -hmm. you have to put the romance aside and deal with the legalities. Yeah. And we've had to do that. Mm. But we spend so much time together. We do so much together that it was um, a, a natural evolution mm. uh, to go into into, into business, business together. Yeah. Yeah. And you, you, you only met in 2007. Mm. It's been how many years? What? Eight, nine? Ten. Ten, ten, years. ten years now. Yeah. But you guys are going strong. Is that a long time? <laughs> it's not. Hence, I say only in 2007, but yeah. it looks like you guys grew up together. I, I believe that's the characters that both of mm -hmm. you have. Yeah. It feels that way. Mm. It, it really feels like we've known each other all our lives. Mm. And um, it's so easy to love Mumpo mm. if you get to know her. Oh, thanks. Um, and, <laughs> <laughs> and I think she's one of the most, you know, incredible people in my life yeah. you know she's got a beautiful mind she's talented she's ambitious uh, but more than anything she's that person that you can rely on and and she's supportive and you don't get that every day in especially in this industry yeah. I think it's always like a shock to people like how are you guys like you know in the same industry and being friends and the truth is we we know when to dance and we know when to clap and we root yeah. for each other and, you know, we, we're always there in you know, each other's corner. Yeah. Um, and friends like that don't come, you know, they along don't. every day. They, they very rarely. Actually, they don't make them like that anymore. They don't, ne? Yeah. So Not oh, like this. Okay. <laughs> Ladies, let's talk business now. <laughs> Back to business now. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about Let's Learn Toys. The idea, I know Mampo went on Alibana and I would want Why to imagine, you, oh, <laughs> Nalungwana, but I would want to imagine Hore. That's where it comes from. But Terry, when you were telling me earlier on about your nieces and so on, but mm -hmm. let's just talk about the concept. How did it come about? Uh, which part? The, the, the business. business. Yes. Well, uh, I think it was one of those things where, you know, as, as, as a caregiver or as, as a parent, as an aunt, um, you know, when, you, when I come home, whenever I travel, I always try to bring a toy because I've got so many little ones in my mm -hmm. life. And, and you think about the stuff that you buy. What am I buying for? my children mm, yeah. um is it something that's going to empower them open doors for them you know uh, open their minds and it starts from there for wanting to give you know our kids the best tools that we can mm. and um and making that accessible to everyone mm. i think it started with our kids like yeah. uh, you know seeing how you know uh, the little things that will get them change their lives and you know and how they've they've grown like you just know that you know there's so many kids out there that need the same opportunities yeah. and the best thing is to create a platform where you can reach out to as many as possible it's true yeah. i know when are your favorite game the brain child and yours uh, mine is travelino look i think uh, 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 most parents will say this i think my little one is pretty gifted and <laughs> <laughs> um I, I do and so i had to find ways to keep her mind active to mm. keep her you know um entertained and and in in, in, a, in a positive way mm. and in a constructive way i think that it is parents' responsibility or our responsibility as a community not to just leave it up to the educational system. Yeah. And because the statistics are so shattering, right. for me, it was so important to ensure that um, we're not only just feeding our children um, physically, but we're doing it spiritually and mentally. Um, and so, and so the, 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 the idea was born mm -hmm. in that yeah. how do we also um, contribute mm -hmm. to building a generation of children that are educated because they have the democratic right to be educated mm. and to know and to learn more. 
you know. Um, and because we travel a lot, we understand how competitive it is. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to make sure that young South Africans are also, you know, if you're not going to be throwing them into the deep end and they can't swim, mm -hmm. you know, they've got to be able to, to, to navigate the waters yeah. of, of this global all oh, right, so emotion. you're launching officially tonight. Tonight, yeah, yeah. <laughs> tonight is the Rosemont. Rosemont. <laughs> you know, yeah, we're gonna be partying, Rosemont. yeah, right. celebrating the yeah. The uh, yeah, I child. wanted to hear about the details of tonight. Where can everyone come? And no, well, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> well, the guest list is, um, I mean, like right now, we, we're getting calls from you know, um our peer agency, the like, guys, you know, mm -hmm. can you stop people now? This is enough. We yeah. can't, you know. Everyone um, wants to come. Yeah, but I think the mall of Bank is big enough to accommodate yeah. everyone. Like, yeah. I don't and know if, you know, the space that we have is enough. Yeah. And I hopefully we'll have enough food and drinks for everyone. Yes. But yeah. one thing that I know is that if people cannot join us tonight, they can still buy the toys. Mm -hmm. uh, they can go to our website or social media. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the stuff will be delivered to your home. And Are they um, affordable, though, in terms of absolutely, pricing? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Like, mm -hmm. you know, go to www.letslendtoys.co.za. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, we've got toys for as little as 29 rands. Mm -hmm. And if, you know, if not for yourself, maybe you want to donate to to a school, to a, to a an preschool, um, an yeah. orphanage. Mm. You know, um, I mean, the idea is to, when we give back, let's try and give back in things that, you know, not only entertain the little ones, but give them, you know, mm. you know the tools to be yeah. better individuals. But what age group are you looking into? We start from 18 months up. 18, mm -hmm. months, 18 yeah. to 18. 18, yeah. 18 to 18 years. To 18 years, because yeah. we we've got like, you know, stuff like for kids that are in high school. Oh. Mm -hmm. um, because we do focus on, on, on the technology, maths and mm -hmm. science. A whole lot of things, yeah. yeah. All right, so are they only accessible um, on the internet? Right now, yes. For right now. now, we're only online. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Okay, ladies, um, we'll leave it at that. Thank you so much. And all the best for tonight and going forward. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. And thanks to South Africa for supporting us. It's been amazing. Yeah. We've had such an enthusiastic um, sort of, mm -hmm. you know, um, mm -hmm. reply. And, all right. So, yeah. for Wayne, besides the Bayadi toys, what's next? What can we expect? Um, I think there's a lot. Um, I also want to keep my life balanced, so I don't want to chew on too much. Mm. You know, um, I have very nice teeth. I <laughs> keep that, keep it that way. Um, but uh, yeah, you I'm are such a character. <laughs> I'm going to be doing stuff with with my Italian link, which is pretty exciting. Yeah. So I'm looking forward to all of that, all linking right. um, South Africa with Italy, um, bringing you know, showing the South Africans the beautiful destinations mm -hmm. that are still undiscovered in in, in the Italian. Beautiful, fantastic. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, there you have it. That's uh, the way we were closing Women's Month here on Morning Live. And I believe we're taking a break. When we come back, we'll be saying goodbye. Stay tuned.